Ryan, congratulations. Third time. Lucky. How good does it feel to win the game up on that famous old stage? You know, I say, growing up, it's every boy's dream. You know, not just to get here, but to win a game. So, um, I know it took three years, but it's worth the wait. Unbelievable. So, yeah, I'm over the moon. How much did you learn from the previous defeats, and how much could you take in to today's game? A huge amount. I mean, even like, you know, three weeks ago, playing at Minehead, playing on Ted against Gary, you're learning all the time. I think I've been on Ted, you know, four or five times, and um, I've learned every time, you know, little bits here and there. I think, you know, tonight there, I showed a bit, you know, when my finishing, when I needed it. So, yeah, it's all experience, I think. Now you're over that hurdle, do you feel you can settle into the tournament because you've won a game, it's no longer the monkey on your back. And the fact that you played on that stage going to attack one of the seeds, is that a plus? Yeah, definitely. I mean, do you know what? Tonight was the first night, apart from the first year I qualified here, I've ever felt like your strong favourite to win. I know he was only 16, but I kept saying everyone's won. To qualify the way he did is unbelievable. So um, every other time I've been on TV, there's been no pressure. I've always played like Gary, Peter, you know, the big names. So there's never been no pressure. So, um, yeah, I mean, tomorrow, back to normal, no pressure on me. So we'll see how it goes. Was there extra pressure as well, knowing that your tour card was on the line? as well and now that you've, I think you've jumped 15 places with that one win in the rankings, how does that feel? I knew about it, but luckily for me, you know, like rankings, money, it never ever crossed my mind when I'm playing, Luck, which is good, I mean, now I've finished, the first thing I said to my manager was like, I think I'm top 64 now, I ain't got to go to Q school, but at the time it never crossed my mind. Before the game, we saw on social media how happy you were, good luck <laughs> message from your beloved in Switch Town, how did that make you feel? Oh, I do you know what? Driving here, I was literally on the way here, and um, I'm a season ticket holder. And I never, I've been practicing with Keith Dello actually, so um, that's probably what done it. But um, to get a good luck, my, you know what, I said to you know, Mrs. My dad, I was like, I never expected this. So yeah, no, I was over the moon. So especially your beloved club, club. So um, yeah, no, I was very unexpected. Do you feel like you're amongst it all now, like established? Now you're in the 64. You played on TV numerous times. Do you feel that now you like belong at this level and can really kick on? Yeah, I do, I do. I mean, I think this is my sixth year and the first four years I was just happy to be here. And now, when I was too old for the youth tour, the development tour, I, know, I thought, you know, it's time to mature a bit, I've got to do it on my own, I've got to qualify the proper way. And I am improving every year, you know, just, just a little bit. And um, if I can keep, you know, a bit of progress every year, you know, I can be, you know, top 50, top 40, and who knows. Peter right next, someone that you've had Previous film on a big stage, pushed him to, to the limit, looking forward to another go at it. Unbelievable. I mean, you know, Friday night, Ali Pali, prime time, the place is going to be rocking in there, so um, no pressure on me. I, I, I just can't wait, really. I just want to get back up there. Right, congratulations, Will. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Ryan, just touching on Fabio making his debut age 16. You were, you were there, not quite as young as Fabian yeah. a few years ago. You must have seen a little bit of yourself in there. I did, but I mean, at 16, I was never averaging what he'd done or done what he'd done. I think I was 18, 19 before I played the development tour. So, um, you know, leading up to it, I kept saying to people, I was like, 16, that's so young. I know I'm only 25, but I was like, so young. So, you know, you know fair play to him at times. He, he did play well, you know, but I think at crucial moments he might have missed. And um, luckily for me, like I said, that experience, I think, kicked in a little bit. Yeah, you say you take a little bit from each of your TV games. Do you think it was those small experiences that got you over the line tonight. I think so. I mean, it's easy to say now once I've won, but um, I mean, even six times on telly or whatever it is, I'm still, like I, said, I still learn myself. So um, I think that little bit of experience might have paid off for myself, but um, yeah, no, I'm just over moon to win, really. You mentioned, obviously, Peter Wright in the next round, world number two, someone that's in the, from the same area of the world as, as yourself. It's, a tie, obviously, on a Friday night that's going to be, yeah. you know, track the massive. Yeah, no, like I say, I think I was 16, 17 playing Peter in my local club. And he, and he say, give me a few words of advice. When I, like, I think I was 17 at the time. But like I say, eight years, nine years later, I never thought I'd be playing him at Ali Pally. So, um, like I say, there's no pressure on me. I'm just looking forward to getting up there and playing again. Did you beat him when you were 16 or 17? I lost 3-2, actually. I think he'd done a 12 and 11 dart or something stupid. So, um... But I've beaten a few times since, so um, like I say, it's all on the night. I think if I can turn up and play my best, you, you, honestly, you never know. So um, I'm just looking forward to going, going again. Cheers, Thank you.
Ryan, does that make you a danger that you can go into this match with no fear and no pressure? I think so, yeah. I'm, I mean, well, there's no pressure on, I can just relax and um, I just love the atmosphere. Do you know what? Just playing here is just a dream come true to win a game finally. So, playing people, no, one, no one's going to expect me to win. So, um, you know, if I can relax, play how I can, I might have a slight chance. Okay, and obviously, if you were to get a result, your name would be through the stratosphere, so that's a big incentive for you, and again, another rise up the ranking. Yeah, no, exactly. It's, you know, it's all about getting yourself out there. So, um, you know, be a big name like Peter tomorrow night could um, make my career, really. So, um, like I said, I'm not going to put too much pressure on myself. I'm just looking forward to going again. Brilliant stuff, Jason. Thank, thank you very much. Thank you.